Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you've seen my previous video on unlocking the Samsung Band selection menu, you'll know it required using ADB. And while it worked for many of you, some users on One UI 8 had trouble getting it to run properly. So in today's video, I'm going to show you a new and actually easier method to access the band selection menu. And the best part is, it should work on the latest One UI 8. Let's get started. Required apps. In this tutorial, you will need two apps. The Google Play Store and an app called Set Edit, which we will use to change the lock screen shortcut button. Start by opening the Google Play Store, tap on the search tab, type Set Edit, Select the app when it appears in the results and press install. Current shortcuts on the lock screen. By default, your lock screen should have two app or tool shortcut buttons at the bottom. In this case, the flashlight on the left and the camera on the right. In this video, we will be modifying the right-hand side shortcut to open the band selection menu. Reconfiguring the shortcut button. Open up the Set Edit app and at the top, make sure that System Table is selected. Scroll down until you find a function called Lock Application Shortcut. Once found, tap on the row and press Edit Value in the pop-up dialog box. The two shortcuts, Flashlight and Camera, are listed here, each starting with a number 1. Don't delete this number when you replace the values as it determines whether the shortcuts are enabled or not. Only one shortcut needs modifying, so we will only be replacing the camera shortcut value. Copy and paste the first package name on screen. For those who can't get the first package name to work, you can give the alternative package name a try. You can find both of these package names in the description. Lock screen band selection menu shortcut. After setting the new activity value, go back to the lock screen. You should notice that the camera shortcut icon has now become the phone icon. You can now click on the phone icon and unlock your device. The band selection menu should open up automatically. You can now select which bands you want to enable and keep deselected the bands you want to disable. After you finish your selection, press the toggle at the top to make the changes. Those who want to revert their lock screen shortcuts back to default, but still want to be able to access the band selection menu, open the Recents menu, press the phone icon, and then press Keep Open. This will stop the band selection menu screen from closing after you press Close All. How to return to default settings. For those who want to revert the lock screen shortcuts back to default, go to Settings and search for Lock Screen. Scroll down and tap on Shortcuts. Tap on Right Shortcut and select any app you want as a shortcut. I chose the Camera app. If you go back to the lock screen, you should notice the change. Thank you for sticking around till the end of this video. I really hope this new method helped you out, especially if you struggled with the older approaches or couldn't get them working on One UI 8. Samsung keeps patching different ways of accessing this menu, so having a method that still works is a big win. Before we wrap up, I want to give a special thanks to the YouTube commenter at Crypto.7562 for sharing this method. They took the time to share something that many people struggling would benefit from, and it's always great to see people sharing what they've figured out to help others. Without their contribution, this video wouldn't have been possible. Definitely show them some appreciation as well. If you found this video useful, please like the video, subscribe for more, and feel free to drop your questions or your experience in the comments below. Enjoy your tinkering, and I'll see you in the next video.